I'm Alex and this is technically not my video. Disco Elysium stands out to me as one of the best games of 2019 for a lot of reasons. The writing is excellent, the characterization of the world and the people living in it is astounding. Visually it's very impressive, but the thing that stood out the most to me was it actually feels like a detective game. From the moment you start the game, it is throwing clues and questions at you. From the get-go, you are forced to question everything. You even question if your character is actually a detective. If Disco being a point-and-click adventure game dissuades you from playing it, I don't blame you. The point-and-click adventure genre was dominated by Telltale Games for years following the release of their Walking Dead series. It always felt like Telltale were just converting IPs into their style of game rather than developing games that suited the IPs they were based on. While they might be fine games in their own right, they make the genre look clumsy and frustrating thanks in large part to their reliance on poorly designed on-rail shooting and QTE sequences. Disco Elysium is a nuts and bolts detective game at its core, and the gameplay is built from the ground up to serve that purpose. You won't run into gameplay sections that are frustrating because they suddenly demand you be good at FPS games or platforming, and then the writing kicks in. Disco presents everything as a question you need to answer or a riddle you need to solve. The opening of the game is literally a mystery to solve and it's just introducing you to the character you play. Who are you? Where are you? Why is your hotel room destroyed? Are you even actually a detective? As the game progresses, the quality and imagination of the writing elevate the whole experience into something otherworldly. It genuinely feels like you've been thrown headfirst into a living, breathing world that you're totally new to while also being hungover. In most detective games, the Batman series by Rock City being a prime example, you wander or fight your way from place to place looking for specific items that give you specific clues and unlock new areas to find new clues in. It doesn't really feel like detective work so much as playing a scavenger hunt simulator. L.A. Noir is probably the last title I can recall that comes close to what Disco Elysium's detective work feels like. And even then, L.A. Noir was ultimately limited by the facial capture technology of the time. You had to use your gut instinct a lot of times, not because the game was mysterious, but because it couldn't accurately convey facial expressions. Disco Elysium nails the feeling of being a hard-boiled detective and it's easily the most well-written game I've played all year. Do not miss it.